Hello everyone, Jimwa JP, and today, uh, Ghostbusters Afterlife, well, Ghost Corpse released a Ghostbuster Afterlife trailer, which is a state buff mini, I think you guys have seen this, just a review, um, yeah, it's pretty interesting, um, looks a bit too much CGI instead of realistic, I mean, with the Stay Puff, uh, Little Mini, let's pursue this, tra this trailer, so I can show you guys. There goes Paul Fig. I wonder if he'll be a Ghostbuster in Ghostbuster Afterlife, I wonder. Or it's just the kids. Who knows? Strawberry, red velvet. Blue velvet. <laughs> So, it might work, I think. I can't wait to see what Ghost will look like. I mean, Mark Stay Puff minis look really PG. And almost cartoony look, but then again, he looks cartoony. <laughs> and then you see all of them. As you can see, I don't know if it's some form of Ghost making these things look like Stay Puffs. And roast, you know, because they don't feel pain, of course. As you can see, this one's... He's actually have two that he's roasting, and one of them are actually already roast. Uh, and one of them jumped on another. It's kind of like the gremlins. People have been saying, if you guys seen that. If you're from my generation, 80s kid. Or have you seen the gremlins? Um... It's, this is what this reminds me of, too. And just like others say, you know, they're like cute, mischievous, savage. So, I mean, it's still hard to tell whether the ghost here will look like this or look more realistic, but in CGI form. More better than the 2016 movie that came out of Ghostbuster with an all female cast. I don't know. But, um, yeah. So this is just based only on this character, Mini Stay Puff, or the Stay Puff uh, mini scene, so. Like this right here. Seriously. They have a blowtorch that they're using to burn one of them into, make them into a s'more. <laughs> And the other one's watching. Um, yeah, I don't know what you guys' opinion on this. You guys like this? I think I can't really say negative stuff. I mean, it looks okay, I guess. I'm not surprisingly. I like Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, one of my favorite um, mascots in Ghost and Ghostbusters. But um, this right here, I have a mixed opinion, but um, we'll see. I have to see more. I have to see more of the movie, more of the ghost, and see before I can say anything. If I, it, I'm between, I'm neutral on this one. But we'll see, because I don't want, I mean, I guess it still has to be comedy, per se. So, I mean, because the first movie second it's actually comedy and uh i guess this is what they're doing on this one too so but yeah um yeah let's just see uh what they'll do with the further as the trailers come out love the new ghost no no ghost uh, design it's like raindrops or metal on it it's rusted looking so, what's you guys' take? If you see this and you guys have anything to tell me based on what you guys think of this, please let me know. I'll be gladly to read. But I have mixed comments on it, uh, thoughts on it. Uh, I have to see more and see if they really get me into this. And I wonder if Paul Fig will be a Ghostbuster along with those three kids. Who knows? Can't wait to see more into it. But I am looking forward for the cereal that's coming out. I might do an unboxing on that. Just, just in, 
tell you guys what it tastes like, maybe. I don't know. But we'll see. Anyways, that's it, you guys. Uh, stay tuned for the next trailer. If it, if it comes out, I'll make a review on that, too. Just to kind of connect this one and give you guys an actual, like, what I really think. And uh, if that matters. Just my opinion.